Hello and welcome. My name is Ajax Post and you join me here once again for the first time in 2023 in Coffee Shop Tycoon. And we start the year in a very good position indeed. Our first ever coffee shop has achieved what looks like four stars. Quite a good result. We're making a fair amount of money. We've got 244 fans going already and we've won a Dulate Award, all of which we'll see in a moment. But I wanted to start here because as you may recall if you saw the last episode we are now able to unlock a second location which is a nice urban vibrant no less a vibrant urban location in the heart of Pinewood and we'll come to that in a moment we'll stop we'll stop we won't, we won't stop it we'll start it shortly but I want to just wrap up a couple of little things in our existing our first shop location now I've not actually gone far enough in the game to know what happens when you open a second location but I think from what I've gathered by by speed reading the forums is you do still keep all your old shops so they're still there working so I, I don't know if you have to go back and manage them we might find that out in today's episode anyway let's have a look at park location a small little place in town now because we won that Dulate award which you can see right there uh, can I can, can I oh there's, there's no drag scrolling uh, you've got to it's all edge scrolling uh, but can I spin you around so you can see it in the window um, no oh something else I want to mention as well where's it gone oh it's <sighs> no we're gonna have to look at it this way there it is it's lovely anyway that's an award for being yes this is the roaster of the year award because we've got such skilled staff operating our coffee shop now all that means we've got our four star uh, pop uh, four star rating we've got a boost which means we get more customers coming in and as you can see yes they are running in but before we get into the shop itself uh, just one thing to notice which I spotted there. I spotted this actually after I finished the last recording where I made a, well part of that episode was dealing with customizing your store shop uh, store, store logos and the identity the branding of your shop I hadn't noticed until I came out of the of the shop and went into editing that yeah, it simply reverses the image uh, on the front of the shop yes that's what it should look like but on, on the back side if you will of Ajax post and no one wants to well nobody wants to see that thank you very much uh, it's simply reversed so I thought what I've done is I've actually created a more a reversible image or a, an image that doesn't look weird in reverse so I want to add that now go to my library I've called it Ajax Sun there it is you see you see that is that should look perfect there's no writing on it which is nice um, do I still want the orange colour or do I want something else in the background? I'm wondering if a sort of blue sky type of thing might work. How does that work? It might work okay actually. So if I don't know, don't don't delete it. That's it. Accept it. Yeah, I think that works. Yeah, because the sun has these extended rays. Um, it does mean the image looks a little bit smaller, but I'm okay with that. Anyway, that's that sorted. Uh, one other thing to admit, um, I, I might have annotated this in the video, to be honest. Uh, I do this when I'm recording. I fail to spot some obvious things. Like, I spent a lot of time in the last episode <laughs> going through and setting up all my seasonal menus. I've got different menus for the spring, for the summer, autumn and winter. But what I failed to do was tick this box, which meant that I was still serving just basically two types of very ordinary coffee. It was so embarrassing when I saw that. Apologies, yes, yeah, so when you set up your seasonal menus, don't forget to tick that box as well, otherwise it simply ignores everything you've just done. Anyway, let's just check how we're doing for supplies. That looks okay for coffee, food. We've got 15 at the moment, I think we're all right. So we're doing quite well. We've got 1.1 in the bank. This is all good. Oh, someone likes us. Was that you? Did you really? This is top quality. You're not wrong. <clears throat> we noticed this in the last episode. Service isn't isn't getting the best 
sort of response. Now we did train our cashier here and gave her a big boost in service. I think she, she learned a lot about herself anyway. Um, I'm just wondering, yeah, it might be worth training the barista as well. Get his uh, service skill bumped up a bit. Uh, it only costs $45. We'll train you in that. I think from what I can tell, they do the training. It takes so many seconds, 19, 20 seconds, whatever, uh, in total. But they can still carry on working. Oh my goodness, we're getting very busy. And we want to keep as many of these people in the coffee shop as we can. Because if they're sat drinking, or indeed eating some of our lovely food, they will possibly, there's a likelihood, there's a better chance at least, of them coming back and ordering a second cup. So, yeah, let's... Uh, drop in another table here I think uh, it was you wasn't it and we had a particular color scheme uh, which I think was that yes we're not gonna buy another one we're gonna buy some seating because that's what you do at tables you sit at them so we'll buy you and we're uh, you're colored you've got the blue seat that's you isn't it yeah there you go, and press B to buy again, uh, there, B to buy again, click it to place it, B to buy again, place it, good, we're done. Back to normal mode, uh, I want to check my uh, my supplies actually, so supply of drinks, we could run out quite quickly so we need to order some more coffee, it, we're currently in spring so I think a regular blend will do nicely for that. Um, food might be alright. How's our coffee doing itself? Uh, where's... Th there you are. We'll use that one first, so that runs out. Uh, no, I don't want to drop it. It says it's fresh. That's good. That's fine. Ah, uh, you see, they're, uh, they're sitting... Oh, you didn't like something. Wow, this is really fresh. Loves the coffee. Doesn't like the service. <clears throat> okay. So hopefully boosting Adam's service level. Only by six, mind. But hopefully that will help. Yeah, people are loving us. Our popularity is gradually increasing. Our decor rating is... Decor Ooh, we need some more food. Buy some more food. Supply. Food. Uh, order food, another crate. There you go. That is splendid. We've only got 19 coffees left. We probably need some more coffee, actually. Gosh, did you see this is this gets so hectic and I don't like playing hectic. <laughs> really upsets. I really can't keep up. Uh, order coffee, that's it. Uh, regular blend, yeah, we'll take some of that. Ooh, and Diona Saunders has reached level three. She's quite happy with her salary. Oh, expected salary, 20. Um, oh, yes, you see performance boost there. No boost. We don't need to boost her performance. I'm happy paying her 20. That's good. Uh, if we go to Diona. Uh, level 3. I'm not quite sure what that means. But all her skills are fine. Service and speed, that's all she really needs, actually, I think, isn't it? Now, one other thing I wanted to start doing at this point is look at targeting our customers. We do get all sorts of information about them. There's nothing trending. Oh, cookies are popular. Now, customers prefer cold drinks, apparently, in spring. But the important thing for me is our market is currently mostly casuals. Now, when you look at your coffee menu, you can see who likes particular types of drink. Uh, so this is liked by average rating by whoever that icon is. <laughs> so, uh, oh, there you are. Yeah, so that's that's most casuals really love a cappuccino. No, I don't. I'm not actually serving cappuccino at the moment. Well, they love the latte and the mocha. Uh, oh, they they are ex. They're experts, aren't they? That's what that is. If we go back to the manager and experts, yes, the man in the top hat is an expert. 
Uh, so uh, it doesn't apply to food though. No, food food is food. Uh, so on coffee, I think if we target our casuals, um, yeah, I uh, the cappuccino, the almond latte, cappuccino frappe. We're going to be in summer at some point soonish, so we might open that up shortly. But let's go for the cappuccino now, shall we? There you go. That's a hot drink all year round. Casuals love it, that's, so that should boost, hopefully, my popularity. And the thing here is to add that to my menus. Uh, drinks, manage the menus, the spring menu, edit that, and add drinks. Uh, we could add the cappuccino. Yeah, they're happy with that. Um, in the summer. Oh! Oh, no, we are serving iced uh, iced coffee. Sorry. I, <laughs> I, as you can see, I'm very, very easily confused. We'll, we'll add that to the summer menu. Good. Right. So that should work for me. Uh, drinks, uh, supply. Uh, we're good for that. We've got 32 beans left. So we'll use you up first. Make sure that runs out. Then we'll brew a new set of pots. Now... Service sucks. Okay, so what can we do here? What I'm thinking is, do we need to uh, train you again? You're level two. So we could train you again for another 45. Let's see what happens. We see when you get to level three, which are not far off. It costs us more to train you, but you do get a much bigger boost in your skills. We'll, we'll see. Besides which, we could be heading out of here anyway soon. Uh, so, uh, going off to another another location. Can we get any more food here? Uh, oh, uh, croissant. Yeah, for the early morning crowd. A croissant. There you go. Oh, something happened. No. No. Uh, you. Oh, you're you're in. You've got a boost. Uh, so my barista is now increased. Well, freshness is reduced 24% slower, so it stays fresh for longer. Next, we will be able to brew something in there. Uh, we'll do the medium roast. That's fine. We could probably do with some more coffee. We'll do that in a second. Oh, we need to add the croissant to our menu. There you go. Has has the uh... ooh everyone's look. Ev mm. <laughs> Why did that change when I was going to say some? When I thought it said something positive. Uh, chocolate cookie that hasn't changed much, has it? I don't think. Right. So what are we going to do here? I think we have got one point two k in our bank balance. Does this tell us what it is in real money? 1,225. Uh, we're serving nearly 500 clients so far. Well, for overall time, I imagine. And monthly profit is looking very healthy. So what we're going to do, we're going to save this away. Saved. And then go out to the world and have a look at opening a brand new location out here in Pinewood. So that's going to cost us $300. We don't know what the targets are. <laughs> We're flying blind here almost. Do you really I would advise you have at least 800 in the bank before you launch it? Yes. Not quite sure why it's called Mr. Danger, but there you go. Maybe, actually, in these economic times we're in at the moment, yeah, uh, opening a new business is dangerous. And you see here, that says one at the top here. Is that I've got one store so far, I'm sure. Do you want to transfer any employees? Ooh. Yeah. Um, we'll take Adam. I think. Right. Oh, hang on. Right. You have a br bonjour. Is, is coffee particularly French? I don't know. I thought it was uh, Canadian. Or possibly Italian. Well, we're selling Italian roast coffee, aren't we? So anyway, sorry, bonjour. You have a bright future in the world of coffee shops. Let me give you some advice. I don't need advice, surely. 
What are you doing here? This is my young apprentice. Uh, oh, hang on, we've got two people talking. I hadn't noticed that. Oh, monsieur, always so unrefined. I mean, I hadn't spotted with Mr. Lato. Was that latte? Uh, how would you pronounce that? Any clues? Please drop a note into the comments box below. Uh, well, I guess we can find a different moment uh, to talk. I'll keep an eye on your progress. Au revoir. I do apologise. My very fake, phony and ridiculous uh, attempt at a French accent. Bye. Always wanting to snatch my students. It's very weird conversations. You are already starting to look like an expert in coffee making, but you still have a big journey ahead of you. Thanks to your reputation, we can start improving your shop in different ways. I will trust you with my researchers. I bet they will help you find ways to different your, differentiate your shop from the competition. That is indeed awesome. Holy brownie, I gotta leave. I left some muffins in the oven. Have fun with your new shop and try not to research any weapon of mass cafe. Oh dear. Mass caffeination. No promises. Uh, the competition is starting to pay attention and you should... Oh, hang on. Oh, right. It's a tycoon game, isn't it? We might be in competition with somebody. Yes, I've contracted a broker. Give you access to the stats of other companies and their stocks. Ooh. Too early. To oh, we can buy out companies. Oh, I will. But I, I know you will eventually get there. Ah, stock market available. You can buy. St oh, oh my. Oh heck, which is that symbol over there? Oh heck, right. Uh, that's uh, the stock market. I've got two. Oh, they've all got. Uh, my reputation is, is zero. No, 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 no. Very, very rude. Ah, okay. Interesting. No trends. I'm. I've got the smallest net worth, but there are a few guys here on the way down. Come and go, barista. That doesn't sound very appetising, does it? Uh, uh, bankrupt. Oh, I say. <laughs> This could get complicated. So we need, uh, we need some equipment. Uh, we need a fancy counter. Now I noticed in the sh in the little uh, icons for the the shops on the world map when you selected a shop, it put the counters at the back, which I I hadn't done obviously as you remember from my my earlier one. But so let's let's try that here. Let's see how that works. There you go. So I, I just seem to like having them along the side. It seemed seemed better that way. Okay, so we've got that there. Uh, we need uh, employees. So we've got uh, Adam, and we need a cashier. Two hundred. Oh my goodness! The thing is, I'm wondering who is doing the baristering in uh, my old park location shop. Okay, you don't need to be a be a barista. But I want good service and good speed, and that is going to be Mariana Reasoner, as opposed to Mariana Shattles. You don't want to employ someone called Shattles, do you? No. So we're hiring Mariana Reasoner. Um, is where's Adam? Uh, or sign? Ah, there you are, uh, as barista. Okay, we're going to need some equipment. We're going to need uh, an intermediate espresso. Actually, I want to actually make. Let's make sure we haven't got anything in our inventory. Oh, we've got the basic espresso. Mm, yeah, I could sell it. Actually, let's sell it. Could do with some money. It's only only got me thirty dollars, but it's better than nothing. Better than a poke in the eye with a sharp stick. Uh, that is an intermediate brewer. And grinder, we're going to need both those. Yes, yes. Uh, a couple of air pots. There doesn't appear to be a. Oh, there is an intermediate, but I need, I need 500 fans for that. Oh my goodness. I'm going to buy two of you. We need some drinks in our menu. Uh, where's. Uh, use seasonal menus, manage menus, create them. What? Oh, we need to add them first. That's better. Right, so this, which menu is this? 
looking at the spring menu. <laughs> My memories, I mean, I, I don't remember. Yeah, okay, right, and, oh, not you, not add you, you and you. Okay, and for the summer menu. Uh, so that's the winter, that's the menus. Uh, that's fine, and food. Okay, that's all in the menu. We need supply, we're going to order coffee. Do we have any more coffee types? No, we're in winter, so we'll go for, um, we'll order that, and we'll order some food. Uh, just the one crate, I think. All right. No, it hasn't arrived yet, presumably. Oh, we'll add them all to the menu. And there, and that's the brownies and the muffins, and we'll have the croissants and the like on the lower shelf. Uh, anything else we need to do here? Do we want to unlock any more of these drinks? Uh, we're in winter now, then we're going to go into spring. So the, oh, the blueberry frappe. Oh, you need a blender for that. Oh, good. It tells you what kit you need. I hadn't noticed that before because I'm obviously not paying proper attention, uh, as we've seen before. Uh, I think we're okay. Finish one research. Ah, okay. Research. No active research. I need 500 fans. Typical. Oh, but before we go, before we open, let's put a couple of tables in. Um, what sort of style should we go for, do you think? Um, not sure. What, what does that look like? Hmm, not sure. I don't, I, um, I don't want to buy it. I don't want to play it. I want to, um, can I escape out of that? No, you've got bought it now, so I've got to place it. Uh, let's spin you around a little bit. Is there no windows on that side? Oh, that'll do. That will do. We'll buy another one. And we'll put that over there, I think. Yep. And we'll want some seating. Like so. Um, ooh, wooden chair or pantone. No, that's a little bit... Mind you, this is supposed to be a vibrant place. Yeah, wait, wait, let's do that, shall we? Uh, but not blue. Let's go Ajax post colours. Orange. That's you. B. That B again. There. There. Keep pressing B. Oh. B. Then click and place it before you press B. B. Place. B. Place. That uh, place. Okay. And... Where's the sugar counter a fancy sugar counter yeah we need one of those and we'll place that i think down here somewhere we'll place it there for the moment and see what happens let's go back to normal mode all right i think we're okay actually we want a menu don't we uh, so that was in wall decorations a menu Yep, and if I turn you, I can put the menu there. Lovely. Okay, I think we are ready to open. Do you think so too? Yep, let's do that. Oh, what's that question mark say? Um, I don't know why. Why is it? Oh, store expansions. Oh, some store. Ah. Some stores support expansions. You can expand your shop from the edit mode by clicking the expansion area and buying their expansion if your shop has reached the required reputation level. Ah, uh, I, I did notice it said outside the window four star reputation required. Oh, oh that's cool. I, li oh, I like this game even more now. This is getting good. Right, shall we open our restaurant? Yes, we've got a boost because it's a new franchise in town and everyone is eager to come see me. Oh, uh, oh, hang on. <laughs> we haven't got any coffee. Uh, close. Sorry. I want the coffee to arrive. 
Uh, is that, that going to arrive anytime soon? Sorry about that, folks. In a few seconds' time. There is the coffee's ready, so we can now brew. So we're going to be dark roast. Yes. Uh, we'll just do the one for the moment. I do need more coffee, actually. I thought I might, but I, th I thought we would uh, get away with... Now, let's supply. With getting just one in to start with. So we want more coffee, and we'll go... We'll, we'll stay with the Italia, I think. Yeah? So another one of those. That's okay. And I think we can open. It's only espresso at the moment. No, it isn't. The, the airport is done. Ooh, nice choice. Whatever that was. Um, hang. I, oh, I didn't give somebody a job, did I? You. Select. Ah, here we are. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry, I'm being an idiot. Uh, you can be cashier. That's right. Good. Honestly, what is this man like? Now you can pay for your coffee. Awesome. Good. And you're happy. Good, good. They like it. They like it. More coffee is here. So we can brew our second AirPod. Uh, we'll brew it from you. Excellent. Uh, the food is holding up. No one's bought food yet. We've currently got 278 fans. People are loving us. Our decor rating is awesome. Oh, we have sold, and spring is here. And I've achieved uh, an overachiever achievement, apparently, which I'm sure is very nice. My reputation has increased. Clients will appear more frequently. Remember to keep them happy. Oh, I can do that. That's not a problem. Oh, Adam, you finally reached level three again. Okay. Oh, uh, actually, no, he hadn't. No, it was Diona, wasn't it, who got to... I really don't know what I'm talking about sometimes, do I? There you go. Uh, you're there. Um, can I train you? I suppose I could. Oh, we've got more coffee in. Oh, and you've... Oh, hang, hang on. Uh, hang, oh, hang on. Pause it. Pause it. <laughs> I'm losing control. Nothing terribly surprising there. I want to train Adam to be even bigger and better at what he does. So I'm going to give him... Can I give him service and roasting? We're not doing anything with roasting at the moment. But it will come into play at some point soonish, maybe? So we will train... That's $70, though. You're worth it. Nuke those beans. Let's do that. And Mariana... Uh, uh, yeah, I need, I need to adjust your salary. I am sorry... Oh, I can't do it till next month. Oh, bother. Yeah, too many screens came up at once and I, I, I didn't notice. I'm sorry. We're in week four of month two. I assume there are four weeks in each month. Yes, there are. But can I? No, I want to adjust your salary. There you go. You're happy again. Can I give you training? Let's, let's give you some training as well in service and speed. Now you'll take you into level two. Service and speed. Service and speed. I think this one is the best. Four and six. Yep. Yeah. There you go. Well-trained staff are essential to any business. And it keeps them a lot happier. Now, we will be approaching summer soon. So I think we could do with... Oh, we're doing very well here, actually. We could do with a new summer drink on the menu. So, cappuccino. Oh, actually, let's look. I did mention this in the last uh, coffee shop. Uh, who our customers are. I want to pay more attention to that. Uh, trending. Oh, it's teens. That's because it's a vibe. And I've got those lovely coloured Pantone chairs. It's a vibrant urban location. Oh, and they love croissants. Okay, so what do teens like in particular that I don't... So you like that, but you're an autumn drink. No. Ah, the mocha frappe. That's... Oh, I haven't got enough money to buy it anyway. Oh, bother. And I'm going to need a blender, which I don't think I have, have I? If I go here, 
I've got brewer, grinder, I can add another air pot and I've got one espresso machine. Yeah, I need to buy a blender as well. How much is a blender? Uh, it's 40. I could do that, but I can't afford the coffee that it's required. I could do with more people sitting down and drinking. Do they... Oh, my reputation has improved. I'm, oh, I'm a two star. Excellent. Yeah, it's got another seven month till the next uh, Dulate Awards. Now let's take a moment, perhaps, look at the stock exchange. Uh, oh, our reputation is doing well. Okay, our trend is up. Let's uh, actually let's pause this for a second while I take a, another look at this. So Triton, they've got three locations. They've got $300 in their bank balance. Ooh, okay, nope. Well, okay, okay, Ingot has got a lot. 1.9K. That's the biggest of them there. But Triton, so what detail do we see here? Last, they don't, are they not giving dividends? Oh, you need to spend, oh, 2.5K to buy any stock. I don't think I'll be doing that. No. Uh, let's say no, cause it, it, just in case, just in case it lets me buy that and I end up sort of 2k in debt. Not a good place to be. What about a slightly less good company like Pleasant Earth Espresso Bar? Oh, that costs. Right. Yes. Yeah, so obviously, it's to do with the valuation of the company. It has got something to do with how much their stock a, a share take costs. Interesting. Is anybody bankrupt? No. Can you re can you re-energize a bankrupt business? That might be interesting. Okay, a little bit longer. Uh, oh, no Wi-Fi. Is that what you're saying? What a ripoff. Oh no, needs music. Oh, I said. All oh, right. Oh, <laughs> you've got to keep. I need five hundred things. Five hundred fans. Other. Uh, Pizza Invader, what's that? A Future of Gaming, Advanced Sugar, Japanese Sugar Tables, no. Um, decorations, uh, it's Columns. Well, this is all very uh, international, isn't it? Uh, oh, yeah, I don't know. Uh, where, where's the music? Oh, is that something you research? Ah, that could be research. Right. Uh, we'll finish that pot off. Oh, I could do with buying more coffee actually as well. Uh, there you go. Uh, supply, order, more coffee. And we'll go with the regular again, I think. Oh, actually, oh, you can change how much you buy. Is that new? I hadn't seen that in the last shop. Maybe I just didn't see it because I'm an idiot. Oh, cool, cool. Right, oh, I like this. <laughs> Discovering new things. That is a that is a great thing about a well-designed game. Particularly something like this building tycoon -y kind of thing, which I like playing anyway, is as you go through it, you discover new things. Not stupid new things, but things that make sense within the logic of the game. Um, have you not sold that coffee yet? Brr. Get on and sell it. Summer is here. I've got 390. Okay, can I... Uh, what does that coffee cost me? Uh, the summer coffee. Oh, that was... You cost me 310 and it's 40 for a blender. Ooh, a f yeah, but you're like by casuals. Not so much by teens. Uh, do I want to spend a lot of money? Do you know what? I'm going to. There, I bought it. I've got a f mocha frapper thing. <laughs> so I'm going to need... Can I do it from here? No. Nope. It'd be nice if you could. Uh, so I need to buy a blender. Now that's a basic blender. Right, we've got that. I've only got $40 left. Uh, oh, I need to add that to the menu. Need to add that to the menu. There we go. Uh, 
drinks, uh, manage the menus. So we're, uh, do we need to add it to spring? No, because it's too cold for spring. In the summer menu, we will add it here. And it gives me a 10% bonus, a buff, as I think some people might say, to my reputation. There you go. Awesomeness. Uh, food supply. And we've got 16 of those left. Drinks. Uh, sorry, supply for drinks. We've got 29 left, as I can see there. Do I need to... Will someone take that ordinary coffee? Oh, I love a lovely little boost. Reputation per order increase by 22%. Lovely. Ah, I can brew some more coffee. No, not using you first. And this is going to be... Actually, if I take it... No, use you for the espresso because you're freshest. So we'll brew you. Uh, I know I haven't got any Wi-Fi. Stop complaining. I know. Uh, order coffee. That is 60 cups. It'll go off, won't it? I think. Yeah. Okay, so we'll order just a 20 cup bag again. Someone stole 20... How? Dar darn it. Yes, let's darn it. No trends. Again, teens are the largest market sector. People love us iced coffee and the mocha. And reports. <laughs> okay, so we so apparently made one hundred eighty-six point two two zero five dollars. Okay, that that's very detailed. I'm not sure real money goes in four decimal points. So of, of five, what? <laughs> Okay, slightly stressed out by that, uh, yeah, by that. <laughs> but we are profitable. Well, not this month because we've just spent on opening up a new coffee recipe. And uh, I, oh, I could spend money on marketing, but we're not going to do that. Right, I think what we'll do, uh, it's going to be a little while before we get to the 500 fans required for research. Which I think will be a nice thing to start off with in the next episode of Coffee Shop Tycoon. So I think we have done very well here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to save that, pause it, go out to the world. Can I go back to my old shop? If I go here, oh yeah, we we oh, we're missing a barista. Right, I need to. So I need to employ someone. A new employee as a barista. I haven't got any money. Oh heck. Okay, so which means Diona will have to do everything. So select roles and barista, which means you, your skills quality is reduced. Oh dear, I shouldn't have transferred Adam to my new sh new shop, should I? Oh well. I, I must remember next episode we'll need to add another member of staff to the park location. But I'm doing well here. We've got two stars. Oh, hang on. Uh, where was the... I didn't... What was the objective for this? Espresso in the city. I've no idea what that means. <laughs> but I think it will tell us. Uh, yes, I am here. That's right. I think it will tell us uh, once we get going. Once we've sort of done the basic objectives of this particular chapter, as it were, it will tell us how we need to... What we need to do to achieve that, that goal. But there you are. I think that will do very nicely. So I will say thank you so much for joining me today for this episode of Coffee Shop Tycoon. If you've enjoyed this, it'd be lovely to hear from you. A little bit of a like, just click on the old thumbs up button would be awesome. But even better, if you've got anything to say about uh, how I'm getting it all wrong, what you think of the game, anything you feel like saying about what I'm doing with the game or the game itself, that would be magnificent. Just drop a note into the comments box below. Other than that, of course, if you've not already subscribed, good. If you've not already subscribed to the channel, you could do that now. And that way you'll know when I upload another one of these, or indeed any of my other Let's Play series. But from me, Ajax Post, here in Coffee Shop Tycoon, until the next time, bye-bye for now.